Okay, let's try this again. Because I just recorded all of this and then my computer was like, no you didn't. So, I'm just gonna, gonna do it again. Okay, so I'm gonna try and show you how to make, take a, uh, a simple CV um, USD and turn it into a CVVC USD so you can make castloids in it. Which I hope all of you will. No. Um, it's quite simple. Here's what the normal song sounds like. I'm using Y to Y. I don't know why. It's, yeah, I don't know why. Um, it's just in my computer, so I'm using it. He doesn't have a push. Um, alright, let's, let's do this. What do these do? So, Senna, you want it to be Senna, so, shorten the Senna, oops, nope, make it an N, highlight, right click, region property, You're gonna be doing this a lot, clear, STP, clear that too, hit okay, hit reset up here, Hit ACPT up here and P2P3. Um, yeah. Do that for the rest of the song. No, just kidding. I'll show you the rest of it. Um, you can stretch the ends a little bit. Oh, um, most of them you want them to be length 60 here, but for ends, you can have them be 120 and possibly more, but it's going to be like Senna. Um, let me show you this one. Senna. I kind of like that better, so I'm going to keep the long end there. So now it's Aka, so just put an, an Ak in the middle of these two. Shorten the Na. The cause can also be stretched. There's a couple ways to do it. This one, um, I need to reset STP on this one. See, it moved. Naka. That gives it a little bit of a space. You're like, Naka. Yeah. Or you can have there just be, um, a space here entirely. That'll make the K sound a little bit more. Okay. I'm gonna use this because I think that sounds the best, so. Ah, well. Put a W in here. Ah. Yeah. Looks funny without that. Um. Clear. That's your pin. I think. Now there's already a space here between the cat and the te. You can just sort of take it and do that, which will sound like this. But if you want to preserve that space, you're going to want to um, lengthen this to 120. Get 
I also have a bunch of vowel endings. They're like, they go in like that. And I think they're fun to use. It's not, it's not really a breathy ending, though I probably will add them eventually. It's just a normal ending. You can play with the pitch a lot easier with them. So this entire thing sounds like... Let's continue. Kimi. Im. I think that's a wa. Wa. Yep. Iwa. Um. This one. Wa. I think there should be a slight space in here. I'm not sure about the song. But the cool thing is you can take that ending. And I also have beginnings for vowels where there's a bit of a space, so they look like that. Uh -huh. If you want it to sound like that. Key. Ida. This is cool because I actually have a just a ash, so you can do that. Um. I don't think you'd want it to go right into it like that. You probably want to have this be length 20 and put a little bit of space in between that and the ta. Stick one of my endings on here. What are you? Well, okay, that's what I thought. Um, the S's you normally want them to be length 120, but there's not quite enough room here, so a length 60 will do just as well. That's here. What are you? Ook. Bar. Yep. Um. Is that a ma? Ma. Yep. Mona. Okay, stop here. Clear. Set the STP. Um, vowel combinations, you can just take this E and make it an I. You can stretch the uh, vowel combinations, so it'll just flow.
so whole thing. And let's see. Oh, there's one more thing I need to sort of explain. Here it is. The kya here, I don't actually have any kyas, but I have a kya and I have ya. So. Make that a kya and make it very tiny. I think it's 15. And stick a yaw onto it. Yeah. A yaw. Oh, right. I don't have it in Romanji right now. Yeah. Yeah. Not a bit out of this range, but that's how it works, just kya. Yeah. Yeah. I think that's everything. For just a general overview. I'll be putting individual cases like in a thread with pictures or something or um I might do another one later. Okay, um thanks for watching. Hopefully it recorded this time, that'd be